Hello everybody, welcome to Sailing Vessel Ruby and the Adventures of Captain Bill. And Angelica, hello. So, so thank you for watching our Sunday Tiki Sunset series. We've been fortunate that uh, every Sunday so far this season we haven't missed any. Um, we are doing the uh, capturing the sunsets from the uh, Winthrop Yacht Club Tiki Bar. So um, you're, you're getting some really nice uh, still photos and some videos of that, a little bit of activity. Um, make sure you watch our main our main channel. That's the uh, again sailing vessel Ruby and the adventures of Captain Bill and Angelica. Okay, um, we're up to about 17, 18 videos there with a couple uh, of videos in queue for a couple, that. Of, a couple of Sunday Tiki Sunset episodes in the editing queue. So uh, there's gonna there will be uh, plenty plenty of content, plenty of episodes coming out. Please keep watching, liking, subscribing. Uh, thank you for being here. Over, over, got a Janata. Here goes another plane. Oh, I hate that noise. Sorry. charge on that plug while we're away from the dock. That plug is just short power.
video again. They captured everything on video and then they went to save the guy. glad you guys are here, but it's just not a good uh, boating day. It's not safe to stay out a long time because we have thunderstorms coming. Yeah. And I don't want to get you guys caught in a thunderstorm. All us, right? So I have to go to the field. Yeah. Hold, hold this course. Yeah, we're going to go back. We have a successful sale here today. Yeah. I'm hangry. You don't have to angry. How is that possible? Don't you throw some chips, Claire. Yeah. Up, up, up in that, right? You're looking right at them, I think. Pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it. More and more and more. Even more, even 
more, even more. Tighten it up, tighten it up so you get some focus. That's it. Hold it right there. Get some focus to the rub. Start coming around. Real hard. Yeah. Real. Whoa! Oh my God. Okay, let that go until it's off the top. Don't let, don't let go of the rope. So they, they can get it off there. Get it off there. Keep going. going right at that boat. Let's do that again. Let it out. Let it out. You did it, yeah, Aim at that sail. Come on, hard left. Yeah. Rob, come hard left. Alright, you gotta get some closer. Kind of straight it out first. Then go back to the where the wind is coming from if you look at the windmill, see? The windmill points into the wind. So, where's the wind coming from? Harrison, Claire, where's the wind coming from? Point to, point, point to where you think the wind is coming from. Yep, take the middle of that, it's coming right out of there. So, we'll go a little, little more like this. I don't want to fall off too much, so we'll have to tack. But yeah, just a little here to the right. Okay, right there, hold your right there. Try to fill that sail up. Come on, whale, jump! Make our day! Our day is already made, but Deer Island over here. Could have been on the outside of that great water. You can't see that. A couple times a year, you see boats hung up on that sea boat going over there. Sailing, Claire. Hey, so you, you've been on the boat before, but it was so long ago you probably forget forget the, the time you were sailing. I brought the little cup guy thing, the little the little rubber guys off the boat. I remember that. Oh, Mr. Mr. Bill. Um, All right, we're sailing with one sail. I have two sails. If we have two sails up right now. We'd be flying, but there's we don't have enough time to do all that, all that work for a short sale. We'll have to plan this work. Maybe you guys could come up early or, or sail a whole day. We get a weather day that looks good. Maybe you could sail from here to Marina Bay or here to Hingham. So you can drop you know, it all. Do some the cars. You have a car waiting for you when you get back. I can shut that. This boat was manufactured, stamped on the back, the day it was manufactured, April 2nd, 1984. The day mom was born? And this boat's almost my number one girl, and then my number, my number, my number one girl, and then my number three girl were born on the same day. My number two girl, or one and a half, and one, one point, one point one. I wonder if the boat's crazy as well.
work? Yeah. Wearing a hat all the time. Yeah, because we got the island, we want to go back to the middle, we got a little more false fetch, a longer area of water. That's why, you know, fetches, uh, long fetches to do bigger waves, and get the protection of protected islands, or land mass protection from wind and waves. So our friends Maggie and Travis are, well, they're not pushing, but they brought up the idea. Us? Very, very exciting vacation. Gonna get a, get a captain out. Uh, on a boat? They're good sailboats. They're very, they're, they're good sailing, but they're both very, very cautious. And I don't think she doesn't like the idea. Did she hire your daddy and Dylan? When I, when I sent my resume to them, they said boat in the year 2000. So wait, Harrison, if the boat was made in 1984 and Papa got it in the year 2000, how old was it when he got the boat? It was uh -oh, I'm not 16 years old. That's the guy, but how old is it now? I, I didn't direct the question to you because I knew you knew how to do it. I'm asking him. How old is it now? Ah, it's the same age as your mother. This boat and your mom were born on the same day. Not the same year, the same day. Well, this was... Wait, I don't know. Okay. And if you can see that boat, that's actually a tugboat. Oh. It is kind of, it has like a wedge in the back of the barge. It's a fuel bar, like gasoline or something, or diesel fuel or something. So there's a wedge, Harrison. There's a wedge in the back of the barge, and the tugboat is behind it. That's the tugboat. The tugboat, okay. with the nose in front of the boat, kind of just fits right in there, and he pushes that barge from one spot to the other. Oh. That's just the whole boat is going to fuel the big one, the barge part of it. Dad say it's okay, right? That's great. That's Diet. Diet. You have a can of ginger ale, Dad? I have 
I once worked on the 36th floor of the John Hancock. Wow. Pretty high up. Yeah. But up to the top many times. There's a new uh, a new lookout place in Boston, right? Mm. Yeah, the at the buildings? top of the uh, the top of the proof. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's really cool. Uh, Claire and I went up there. Yeah. It was really they have nice. the restaurant up at the top of the hub. But they yeah. have the uh, the, I don't think it's well it's it may not be called top of the hub anymore. Oh. No. It's something else. Uh, it's a different ah! oh, it's called- yeah. yeah. It was cool. It was uh, really cool. Oh, Munson went out. Yeah, but he's just trying to be helpful there. So maybe you say something instead of that, just say, just one second, Harrison, I'm just showing you for a second. I'm good. Okay, well, I'm, remember, we're, we're working out with Barbara, right? So we can communicate with each other. That would be a good example. That's all. Same message. I'm trying to give me a second, I'm eating right now. Because I already said it. <sighs> give me a second. Can you open this, Papa? And is that what uh, is that what ten hours of Fortnite looks like right there? This is the ghost of a kid. Was it ten hours? Oh, uh, was it twelve? Thousand five hundred people at least went into my vi- my one of any one of my videos and watched it for ten seconds before they got out or two seconds. But the average watch time on my videos is fifty four seconds, which my average video length is about eight minutes. Robert, see the Elks over there with the two uh, uh, aiming that way. excited about this one our first sale of 2024 it took quite a while um, for a number of reasons mostly the projects that I've been working on I've been talking about all spring and into in, in midsummer uh, my my daughter and her husband Rob Lindsay and Rob and my two grandkids Claire and Harrison they joined us um, we kind of got a late start uh, on a Sunday one ish in the afternoon with thunderstorms predicted to arrive between two and three. So it was a short sale. We put the jib out. We went out by Deer Island, Deer Island Light. Um, there was a report of a mink whale in that area today. That today. So we were kind of hoping that it uh, would have been exciting for uh, everyone, the kids, for everyone to see that mink whale. We didn't see it. Um, there wasn't a lot of boats out there because of the weather uh, predictions of uh, thunderstorms. It was cloudy, it was a nice wind. Uh, the boat ran well, we put the jib out, it sailed well under one sail, we got the engine off. Um, but we just did a turnaround. We went out, you know, 30 minutes or more, 30, 45 minutes out, 45 minutes back, safely into the dock. Uh, we weren't back into the dock for long before uh, the thunderstorms arrived and it, and it rained and rained hard here. Uh, on Sunday, August 4th, so uh, uh, weathermen were kind of right this time. So, thank you for watching our video. Thank you. Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Sh- thank you. See you, uh, see you in about a week. And have a look out. 
we got we got a couple of uh, videos in edit mode. Uh, at least two tiki sunsets in edit mode, so we'll be releasing uh, Fast and Furious here. The good part about that means um, we're getting caught up on our content. Uh, we're not thin on content anymore. We got a lot going on. We're capturing a lot of videos, so hang in there. Please always watch our whole videos, like, subscribe, and uh, see you soon. Ciao, Brigada Janata.